Welcome back to Jules Sports Card. Spring is coming, and we got a box of 2023 Tops Series 1 baseball. It's a blaster retail. Everyone's saying that these odds that you see here aren't very conducive to us, the Ripper. But this side gives us actually a better kind of breakdown than than Tops usually does. This feels a little Panini Jace, to be completely honest. To see a little bit more of the like, oh, here's the fun that you could get. And it like is super well articulated. So I like that. You got Julio, the cover boy. Everyone knows that he's getting marketed more than really other cover boys, which is sweet to see that maybe the hobby is going to expand to non-card collectors and really start to enter the sports fan zone too, which is great for all of us that are currently in the hobby. More eyes equals more success in a lot of ways right um seven packs per box one exclusive commemorative patch which is not a bop i'll be completely honest but you got these gold mirror base parallels the thing with top series is you really gotta look at all of the like ssps and like the back is it numbered is this the 88 variation that's just a standard insert or is it going to be numbered out of 88 so that's my one beef. If I were to be talking to fanatics right now, I'd say make it more obvious what you pulled. Um, for us who've been in the hobby for a hot minute, it's sometimes challenging. What about somebody who's new? If they just like pull a card, they can't always tell if it's extra sauce or not. Because, I mean, you know the player, right? Shohei. First of all, I love the design of Tops this year, Series 1. So good job by you. Um, really like the, just the bottom. Uh, you got a good amount of rookies in this product. I'd say there's a top five, and we'll see if we pull any of them. Buddy Kennedy, not on the top five. That's a sweet Quan. Quan in the outfield right there. So here's a backwards card, right? Not numbered. Cody Clemens. You got the rainbow foil. Okay, so a rookie rainbow foil not really the exact name you're looking for but hey that's sweet to get a variation on a rookie and you never know right so i think then this is the stars of the mlb that's a kind of cool picture garrett cool uh you know different people have their opinions on stars of the mlb low key i think it actually is a fun set to collect it's not the 330 base cards that you gotta find to have a complete set of top, top series one but it's like manageable to get and it's all the best players so yeah there's like one in every pack and if you rip a decent amount of retail you're just gonna get so much of it but it's a small set build that i actually low-key love so i'm a stars of the mlb guy that's a sweet pick you gotta love it but i understand when somebody sees too much of any card like, you get a little salty to it. I also feel like they did good job pictures-wise here. Okay, here we go. That one's cool. Mookie Betts, 2022 Greatest Hits. And it's red. Not numbered. But that's a nice one. We'll put that right here. I like that a lot, actually. That one looks sweet. Background sick. Got our second stars of the MLB. Chubby Devers. And then I don't like how many... Sideways cards there are, slash, right here, you get, like, just random, like, teams and different things. You can see the thickness of the packs. One of them will have the commemorative patch. It doesn't feel like it's this one. This one's the standard. Steel Walker. <laughs> if that's not a name that's, like, made up by Homer Simpson to sound like a fancy, smancy creepers. Superhero, I don't know what is. Hunter Brown. So none of the big names yet on the Rooks. We're waiting for it. But hey, this is actually, I'd say, tier two. Tristan Cassis. Cassis. My apologies. Don't berate me, comment section. Paul Goldschmidt, Goldie, MVP last year. Not as relevant uh, this year of that card. But hey, you got a third. Another Mookie. Mookie Betts. See, we're already <laughs> chugging along to finish that set. But I do then get it's frustrating if I were to buy a second blaster box and you get like the repeat of different ones. That would be frustrating. So I hope they did a decent job of switching up the print run that not every blaster is going to have like the same 
six or seven guys. I really, the cards feel nice this year. I, I honestly think the cardboard that they're printed on is, is pretty nice. I, I'm pro the cards this year for just the standard base. There we go. Standard base of Gunner. Uh, my favorite rookie of this year. I mean, you got Adley. You got Riley Green. You got, um, now I'm like, hey, there we go. A Julio too. Julio's nice. Technically his tops rookie card in terms of series one but you get the little golden cup and here we got cortez low key if if you've seen hoosier pulls you can't tell me that guy doesn't look like hoosier pulls i i gotta i gotta tweet at him or something that's hoosier <laughs> I, I mean it as a compliment i hope he would take it as a compliment nestor nestor pulls is a is a pretty good channel name pete alonzo on the stars of the mlb i had a thought that just completely went away after <laughs> looking at Nestor and seeing Hoosier. That's too funny. Uh, I don't know who I look like. Shout out in the comments if you think I look like any baseball player. I don't get that often. Um, people say that they recognize, like they, they look like somebody. I look like somebody they know. But not a famous person. Just somebody they know. We got the thick commemorative right there. You can see it right there. We'll see what the name is. Just look at it. Like, it's cool picks. It's, they feel good. Ian Anderson. And you get a lot of cards here, too, right? And a lot of rookies. And people love that. People want a chance to be excited about following some of these guys and seeing where they end up. Hey, we go. Home run challenge of Chisholm. Hey, that's a fun one to be able to pick a game for a shot to win. So, you, like, register this card. Oh, jeez, it's the Mookie Rip. You register this card, and then if uh, the guy hits a home run, he'll be entered into the grand prize of going to see the home run derby. So people also are seeking these. Um, you can sell them for a decent decent return. Uh, and then, actually, the Mookie's not terrible for the commemorative patch. It just is so, like nothing and honestly the design doesn't really pop they got to do a little bit more with it than just like his head peeking out of the circle but it is what it is all right here we got our freddie freeman stars of the mlb it's a new one each time and then unmatched energy that's how i feel about the horizontal cards you cannot match my energy on these things the slides are the only ones that i kind of like when they go um, horizontal because at least then they're like they make sense which like josh harrison i feel like every year his card is a horizontal because it's like when you think of josh harrison it's kind of the best thing going is that an altuve dig patrick wisdom wise guy over there with the with the dig a yadier <laughs> they thought it was gonna be on hey jj blade um not a big chase and he was a hyped prospect coming in. And so he's got a chance. Hey, no such thing as a bad trout. Swimming upstream. Vinny, another one. He's got the gold cup. He's got the rookie uh, card. It's not bad. I'd say tier two. Not one of the big chases. Um, one, two punch. Not my favorite insert. i to keep a pushing on that one. Jose Ramirez. Just never a flattering angle of a picture of him. <laughs> Caleb Killian. Hayes. Seriously, so many pictures of Mookie Betts in this rip. It's unbelievable. This is by far, no way, the Mookie Betts rip. If you're still watching as I enter the last pack and you're not already sub subscribed to the channel, please just hit the stop. Pause it. You got to pause. When I'm paused that hard, you thought I was paused. I'm pretty sure that's my second one, Soto. I'm not feeling that. Yeah, okay. Here's my little cranky pants. You all know when I get the repeat print run, I get salty. We literally had all of these here. You know, my last rip, NBA Hoops, and the rip before that, Don Russ, I was super salty to you. We got a blue here, Gregory Soto. Not numbered, but colored. I just get so mad, unreasonably mad when it's like, man, I want to see new cards. I don't, I don't want to, especially like, it's one thing to have, you know, buy two hanger packs and you get the same print run. This is one box and they have the same 
card in. And it wasn't even the Gunnar Henderson one. Um, okay, all that being said, it is what it is. I would say the best cards out of this, those three are nice. And then probably the Mookie. Maybe this is top five. I mean, the, the best, even though it's just a base, is for sure the Gunner. I'm really excited to see how he plays out this year. I mean, this this home run challenge. Oh, yeah, yo, Julio. Anything Julio is just interesting to people. Uh, and then the Jazz Chisholm. Pick a game winning shot. And then probably the Mookie over the Cody. I'd say those are the top five. Uh, tell me if you would put something else in here. If you're a big commemorative patch person, I would hashtag not respect it for reals. <laughs> and shout out. I can't get over it. Okay, Hoosier is is much more trim. But that's Hoosier. <laughs> All right. I gotta go follow Hoosier Pools if you don't already. The guy's a stud. Okay. Top Series 1, it's actually a fun rip. You get a bunch of rookies. It gets you excited for spring. I would say don't go crazy and get, like, seven of these. <laughs> you know, hobby boxes, really not that expensive. Go take a swing at that. But also, like, I don't know. I think i got a ton of good cards here to be excited about. Start working on my Stars of the MLB set. I already got seven of them right there. And uh, you can pull color, non-numbered color, which is weird to me. Um, when it's like base color, I just think it's not great, right? It feels like MA Hoops does it. You got to go the chrome color route to really get it to pop. But got a gunner, so I'm stoked on that. Pulled it myself. So proud. All right. Thanks for watching, y'all. If you're not following me on TikTok, Joel Sports Cards, please do that. Twitter, Joel Sports Cards. Until next time, y'all, keep ripping. Peace.